next question. Hello, my geeky guys and gals. Welcome back to another Would You Rather. I'm your host, Sick Mars Geek. I'm sick because, well, I mentioned it in the previous video, but I'm going to mention it again here because I do release them at a different time. But I am currently got the man flu. I've got a sore throat. I'm not feeling good. I should be in bed, but no cold or sickness is going to stop me. Death could him, himself could be knocking on my door with pneumonia, Thor's hammer, and I could not care. Nothing's going to stop me. Might stop me from shouting because I've got a sore throat, but nothing's going to stop me from getting videos done. Might also stop me from doing proper English lang language thing, that, but it's going to stop me playing games. <laughs> <coughs> 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 There we go. So, right off the bat, I'm coughing and choking already. Good start. So I thought, what can I do to at least get a video out? So I've already been recording straight away before this. I've recorded a quick draw, and now I'm doing Would You Rather. At least it's a nice, good little fun game for completely free of charge, because it's on the played via your web browser of choice. So the link's in the description below. You just click it and straight away play it. No downloading, no nothing, and it'll work on Windows. It'll work Mac, it'll work on Linux, it might even work on your smartphone, I don't know, we'll see. Anyway, so this is Would You Rather, been a long time since we've played this, we're kicking it straight off with Would You Rather Skip Summer or Skip Winter? Well, given that in summertime it's nice and hot, I can go outside, I can play, I can even now play with the kids, winter time there's bum fuck all to do because it's freezing all the time, your nuts just go straight up into your body or if you're a woman your nipples might get hard at this time for a different reason that's how you can tell you're cold so for me it's easy I'd easily skip winter no doubt about it and 68% of people that's played this also agree that's another thing as well it'd be great if uh, the cold the you know sickness disease cold thing could also be skipped just like winter that kind of cold hey Jobs are good. So, moving on to the next next question. Ah, sorry about that. Would you rather stand on the red hot cut burning coals for 30 seconds without moving or shut your hand in a waffle iron for two minutes? Um, they are both mightily painful. And I have actually done hot coal walking before a long time ago, long before I met my um, current partner. And the thing is, you can actually walk on burning hot coals because if it's burnt properly, there's a layer of soot that thins the uh, the a film of soot is on the top of the coals itself. So there's a good bit of insulation on there. So as long as you walk nice and quick without being too quick. And in a reasonable pace, your feet don't actually go into the hot coals themselves, they just stay on the ash. So you can go straight across that, no problem. But you've got to keep moving. If you do it at the wrong pace or do it at the, um, the wrong angle, your feet can go into the hot coals, and yet it can be pretty damn painful. Another problem with that, though, is as well, is the coals underneath could even stick to your feet and do even more damage to you that way so it's really really bad whereas rough lion yeah you're just going to stick your hand on there and you've got to do it for 2 minutes not 30 seconds so standing without moving for 30 seconds I'd rather do that because they're both going to be painful as all shit but at least 30 seconds is up and over if any coals have stuck to your feet they can just be brushed off yeah. The, the wounds can be disinfected, you can be treated right there and then on the spot and you could be up and ready to go within a few hours, no problem. So considering that I've done it before, I am going to do with I'd rather stand on them hot burning coals. Fucking logic wins. I am cool. <laughs> Next question! Ugh. Sorry about that, shouldn't do that. Would you rather get a hundred dollars today or get a dollar a day for two hundred days? Um, depends on how needy you are, really. Uh, for me, I'd rather like the investment because then you can just put the dollar away each time and 
put it into your little money back and you got $200 rather than $1. Of course, obviously, it's going to take you over six months to get that. Um, but yeah, that's, that's, for me, that to me is sounding more like a sound investment. Save a little for a better investment later on in the future. 200 days, please. Thank you very much. Thank you very much as well, 62% of those that's played it. Would you rather check your email first every morning or check your social network social networks first every morning? Yeah, I'm a sucker with it now. Because I do the YouTube. YouTube is considered a social uh, show, show, social network. Um, Twitter definitely is. Squonkle <coughs> 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 me. And I've got my web browser configured in such a way that when it opens up, I, it opens up to a Google web search, it opens up then also to YouTube on another tab, and then my Gmail on another tab, and then my Twitter on a fourth tab. So that's my fourth tabs I've got set up. And first thing I do is I go to Twitter, then I go to YouTube, and then I go to, to my Gmail, because really all I get in the Gmails these days is... Uh, emails about what I've received in the social media, like comments, likes or um, posts on here, so yeah, first thing I'd do, check social media, what a world we're living in, I can remember a time when we used to check emails first before anything else, next question, would you rather play for the Red Sox or play for the Yankees, well given that I'm not American, um, I don't know the, um, um, skill of either of those two teams um, if you are American you probably know and probably going to get a hate either which way I pick so I'm just going to go eeny meeny miny mo catch a tiger by the toe and highlight the whole thing instead so I think it was Yankees I did but I still got my majority so say what you will as far as I'm concerned I got part 65% so I am fine next question <laughs> Next question is, is my ass keep going to die? Yes or no? Probably. That's not an answer to yes or no, is it? Fucking hell, I don't fuck up on my own questions. Would you rather sleep on a pillow with a blood stain or sleep on a really hard and uncomfortable pillow? Uh, there's no notes at the bottom on this one. So it doesn't say how long you're going to have to sleep for or whether that blood stains fresh or not. We don't even actually know what that, what type of blood that is. It could be blood spilt from the body, from a cut or a wound. You don't even know how big that blood stain is. It could also be um, menstrual blood. It could happen. It really could happen, depending on where you put the pillows. Um, I sleep on a really hard, un uncomfortable pillow. Nah, I wouldn't do that. Because it doesn't say about how big the blood stain is. It could only be a little spot. And it could even actually just be on one side. You can always just flip it over and sleep on the other side. So I'm going to go with blood stain. Fuck no, hell. Half and half nearly. Oh, oh. logic wins out again. Oh, man. I have any comments on that. Yeah. No comments. Okay, moving on. Would you rather... Mm, sorry about that. Cough drop. Would you rather win a one-day shopping spree to any store or uh, win a two-week vacation to any destination? Ooh. That's a good one. That's a really good one. Ooh. You know what? As much as this one is really good, a two week vacation to any destination, I could then go anywhere I'd like. Obviously, all the food and the drink and all whatnot is going to be included because it's something that we want. <laughs> but. When after those two weeks are up, you gotta come back and you gotta live the same life that you've been living up until that point anyway. So it's like just a two week off from the day of the rig roll. And for me, I don't have a lot. I mean, 
<sighs> Squeeze on me. Sorry about that. That's why you get with the cold. <clears throat> so as much as the two week vacation is okay, I would actually rather win the one day shopping spree because I'll get straight down to the game store, buy myself a PS4, and buy myself an oh, I don't need to buy it, I just it's a, a day shopping trip in it. So I don't need to buy it. So I get PS4, I get Xbox One. Let's see if there's anything I can upgrade my PC with if possible. I mean, it doesn't even say if there are any comments on this. Um, no, there's no restrictions. So I could even, I could even use that as say one, one day shopping spree to any store. Amazon's a store, it's an online store. So I could get my PS4, my Xbox One, all the games for both systems up to the present day that's currently released and then get a shit ton of new hardware for my computer to beef it up get a couple of 1080 Ti's get myself a nice 77750 I think they yeah. are you know, a really top end CPU new motherboard obviously to go with it a ton of new hard drives um, a few more NAS servers to store all my YouTube videos on I'd be golden. I could play any game I wanted for you. I think I could even get um, Steam gift vouchers as well. So even though I wouldn't need to actually physically buy a game on Steam there and then, at least I can buy the gift vouchers, put them in my wallet, and say, right, what game do you want me to play next? And then just punch it in, buy it, and use my um, um, store code vouchers. That'd be awesome, and it doesn't say, say there's any limit as well, so I'd probably buy myself a good five grand worth of Steam vouchers and top that up and <laughs> go get whatever I want. So I'm gonna go with a one day shopping spree. Ingrates, no one's logicking these new things out at all. Would you rather death by freezing? I think that's saying die. By freezing in Antarctica or death by walking through Sahara. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So basically, it's, would you rather freeze to death or would you rather dehydrate to death? Um. I think, personally, just for me, I would rather go death by walking through Sahara. Mainly because it's not an immediate death that you're going to experience. You're just going to feel very dehydrated. You're just going to feel very warm. You just try and do what you can to go, go wherever you need to go and just get some help, obviously, with death on your doorstep like that. And as part of this... Um, example just for the question you obviously need to get to where you want to go so it's just going to be getting throat dry and you're like really tired and then you're just going to be real nice long warm sleep forever because you're not just going to die straight away you're just going to fall over get yourself into a comfortable position mind you unless a see, um, sand snake or a scorpion fucking stings you or bites you or whatever I know it's going to be painful, but still, you can't keel over in the Sahara, you would still be conscious for at least a little while, until your tan's done, at least on one side, and then you die, you won't even know it, so for me, I'm going to go for Sahara, fucking hell, really people would rather, rather freeze to death, oh come on man, okay, well last one and then I'm going to end the video here, so, would you rather wear the same thing every day, or never wear the same clothes twice? Well, that's piss easy. I never wear clothes anyway. I'm not even wearing clothes right now, believe it or not. I can't show you, obviously, because then I get a channel struck off from YouTube. <laughs> <coughs> 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 
Mm. <coughs> <coughs> ah. No, I'm not going to perform for anybody either. Ah, oh, certainly not in the state I'm at right now. So, wearing the same clothes every day. It don't matter how many times you shower yourself. I mean, I'm going to assume that you'd be able to take your clothes off at least for a short while just to bathe yourself and wash yourself and get yourself fresh but you're going to put those stanky, stinky, sweaty things back on you straight afterwards and you're still going to stink no matter how much deodorant you put on no matter how much fabric conditioner you put on you're still going to stink and if you get on the public transport you're pretty much guaranteed to have that vehicle to yourself so for me I am going to go and never wear the same clothes twice. Because you can easily just have two types of clothes and put one in the wash while you wear the other one because it only takes about an hour or so to wash and then you're done. So that's it. Never wear the same clothes twice. Easy. So anyway, that's the end of this video, my geeky guys and gals. Or would you rather? It's been a long while since I played this kit, but that's what we do. What's that? Oh, that. Oh, that. Oh, that. Oh, that. That's what I do when I get a call. I play the simpler game so at least I can get a video out for you to hopefully enjoy. Is my voice creepy, sexy or non? I don't know. I'm going to leave you with a question. See what the next question is. So, would you rather never be able to comp compliment or never be able to complain? Put the answers down below and let me know because... I'll answer afterwards. I'm not going to answer in the video. I want to see what your answers are first. So anyway, thanks so much for watching this video, my geeky guys and gals. Do all that good YouTube stuff. Like if you like, dislike if you don't. Leave a comment if you want to. And subscribe if you want to know when the next video is coming out. And be part of the notification squad by hitting the bell icon as well next week. And I'll see you in the next video. So bye bye. For now. Conscious that my cough drop could be seen and you're stuck in the tooth with teeth. Nah, I've never increased the audio though.